everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla, and if you're interested in lifestyle videos sprinkled with magic, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I am super excited for today's video because we are doing a collective summer haul. I realized I have a bunch of things that I haven't shown you guys yet. Like, I haven't shown you guys what I got from Disneyland Paris. I haven't shown you guys what I got from Disneyland. And I also have some fun summer pieces that I picked up that I wanted to share with you guys. So today we're going to be diving into all of the things. I'm super excited to share with you guys what I got, so let's just go ahead and dive in. I'm going to go ahead and start off with all of the clothing pieces that I recently picked up. So if you guys have been following me for a while, you guys would know that I love Princess Polly. They have so many cute pieces. They're always coming out with new items, and they always have sales. Like, I'm pretty sure if you guys look at different influencers or like on YouTube or whatever, you could probably find a good discount code. So that's what I did. My friend Cassie, she actually worked with Princess Polly, and so she had a discount code so I had to take advantage so the main reason that I made an order in the first place was that I wanted to pick up a vest I feel like this is super trendy and really in right now and I just thought it was super super cute I actually made an order before but then it didn't fit I originally picked up a size 8 but unfortunately it didn't fit my chest so I had to exchange for a bigger size but I love how this fits I think it looks really 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 cute it's just this really nice beige like neutral color and this is called the Merson vest and I love it I'm planning on wearing it to a music festival that I have coming up because I think it'd be really cute with like some cargos so super excited to style this I also picked up a few skirts I've really just been in like a skirt era lately because they look so cute and they also are comfortable to wear because they are a skirt and like they have built-in shorts under so I picked up a few so one is this actually this isn't a skirt yeah this is just a regular skirt and it's just this really cute simple lilac skirt and i believe this is like a linen material i want to say but i really like purple as you guys can tell my closet is like neutrals or purple so i wanted to pick this up because i thought it was really really cute and i picked this up in a size eight and it fit me really well and i also really like the length sometimes i struggle with like too long skirts because i'm only 5'2 so sometimes like a mini skirt could just be like like almost to my knees which I'm not really it's not really the look I'm going for so I feel like this really fit me perfectly and I really like the fit it's really comfortable so I'm really really excited to wear this and then the next skirt is actually a skirt like I mentioned earlier but it's just this plain black one and I thought it was really cute it's a really nice stretchy material and I just thought this was super essential to have because it's like a neutral color so you can mix and match this with pretty much everything like this would be cute with like a button-up or it'd be really cute with like a tank top and and you could even like dress it up and dress it down so I thought this would be a really good piece and I thought it's really cute like it just has like this little baby slit on the side here and then it kind of has like a dip like a V lining I don't know if you guys can tell it kind of has like a little bit of a V lining so I really like the skirt it feels like a really really nice material and I'm excited to style this as well because I just think it's so cute and so comfortable and again a basic staple that you need in your closet and the last item that I got from Princess Polly is definitely way different than anything I have currently in my closet but I wanted to pick up a cute summer dress that was like a little bit brighter and floral so I picked up this adorable little pink dress and yeah I know pink I'm slowly getting into pink I did two Barbie looks on my Instagram and I was like is pink my color so I've been a little bit more into pink now so I picked up this pink dress and I just think it is so pretty it has like this nice lace detailing here under the bust and then it has this really cute tie detail and I feel like this neckline just looks really really flattering on me and it's just a really comfortable fit the only thing about this dress is that I wish it actually had adjustable straps so only has like these string straps but other than that I think the dress is a really nice fit it's really comfortable and I think this is just so cute and perfect for the summer and even like for the springtime and I feel like you could probably even get away with this for the fall by just like throwing on a denim jacket especially here in the Bay Area it doesn't get like too cold yet so either way I'm really really excited with this dress and this was definitely a pleasant surprise so I'm excited to wear this because 
it's just so cute so pretty so feminine and I love it so that was pretty much everything that I got from Princess Polly the next few items that I got are from love bonito and I've been seeing this brand so much on social media I've mentioned this before but I'm so easily influenced like if I see a product or just like a brand enough times I probably will buy from there so I only picked up two things and I wanted to pick up more from their website but then I just didn't get the sizing right and then like some of the items that I did get in I wasn't like in love with the fabric or just like different things like that but anyways I did keep two items the first item that I got that I'm really really excited about is this midi skirt and it's really different I want to say this is kind of like a cargo material and then it just like ties here on the waist but I really like how it has like all of these pleats here but then it kind of has a slit here and then the other side of the fabric is just like plain so I thought this was really cute and really really flattering plus I also really liked how I could wear this skirt for different work occasions or like family occasions or just like different occasions where I want to be a little bit more classy a little bit more covered up so I just thought this was a really good option I feel like you could wear this with like a white long sleeve or you could just wear it with like other basic tops and I feel like it'll be really cute and I'm just really excited to wear this and have this because it's just something so different than anything else that I have in my closet and I'm really not trying to just like get repeats of everything and I'm just trying to add some more variety as you guys can kind of tell so I'm really excited to wear this this is such an interesting and unique piece and it fits me really well so I'm super happy with this and I also want to warn you guys that pay attention to the sizing because I made like two orders pretty much because I didn't get the sizing right but they are based in Singapore I want to say so they do have like Asian sizes so just make sure you pay attention to the conversion charts and then you'll figure out the sizing and everything the last item that I got from love bonito is this really pretty silk top and I just love how feminine again this looks without being too revealing so it just has a really high neckline as you guys can see here and it's kind of like a racerback top like in the back it looks like that I just really liked this piece because I thought it was like an elevated basic like it's a really neutral color but then you could also mix and match this with like a lot of different items like you could wear it with jeans for a little bit more of a casual look or you could dress it up and wear it with like a midi skirt and I feel like there's just like a lot of different ways that you could wear it so I'm really excited about this and again it's just like this neutral satin material and it feels really nice and again it's also something that I could wear for like different family occasions and also different work occasions so yeah as you guys can tell I'm kind of trying to lean towards clothing that I could also wear to different work occasions and wear casually so I'm really really excited about this top I just need to like wash all of these clothes so I can wear them I don't know about you but I typically just like to throw new clothes in the wash before I wear them just so I like make sure it's clean you never know in the store if like people try it on or not so yeah anyways I'm really excited about this order and I definitely will be buying love bonito in the future now that I have like their sizing and everything figured out so the next few items I got are actually from a small shop called Adelaide's Fort I believe I've talked about her shop multiple times on my channel already and I love her shop she always has so many cute designs and she is pretty much my go-to shop for when I just want like a comfy Disney tee so as you guys can tell I picked up two more Disney tees you guys know that I I love to play tennis so I saw this design and I thought it was super cute I really like this sage green color and it just says waltz club and then it has two rackets on there with like little Mickey ears and then it also says park athletics and then I believe the two years is like Disneyland opening and then Disney World opening so 1955 for Disneyland and 1971 for Disney World and I just love wearing these big oversized t-shirts when I'm running errands or I'm kind of just like relaxing at home and I'm definitely gonna wear this one on the tennis courts the next t-shirt I've been wearing like non-stop I'm pretty sure I wore it like a week straight but anyways <laughs> You guys know I love mermaids. I'm obsessed with mermaids. So I picked up this t-shirt. I literally saw it like on five different people and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get it. I think it's so cute and I have absolutely no regrets because it's just so stinking cute. But it basically says 
meet me under the sea and then it has like all these little seashell details and i really like this t-shirt because it's disney like it's obviously little mermaid themed but it's like a subtle disney because there's no sign of like princess ariel or like no mickey or anything on it so like i just think it's really cute i feel like it leans a little bit more towards like mermaid decor so i love it and i've already styled this on my instagram and it's just so cute and comfortable and again i've literally been wearing it so much since i got it so definitely check out adelaide's for if you guys are looking for some cute Disney tees and that was the perfect transition to move into all the things that I got from Disney so first I'm gonna share with you guys the few items that I picked up for my recent trip to Disneyland I just went to Disneyland in the beginning of June I believe and I still haven't shown you guys what I got I suck I know but I only got a few things like I think pretty much ever since I became an annual pass holder I go pretty frequently so like when I go on my trips and stuff I only pick up like a few items so anyways this is what I got so the first item is I got a cute little pin you guys know I'm a pin collector I have so many random pins that I need to like put away but anyway so I picked up this adorable live action little mermaid pin and I just thought it was so pretty like look how stunning Hallie looks like I just think she looks absolutely gorgeous and then I believe it has flounder and Sebastian on there and I just think Hallie looks so pretty as Ariel and I definitely wanted this pin to commemorate the live action little mermaid movie because The Little Mermaid is like my favorite Disney movie like Ariel is my favorite Disney princess like besides Mulan and this just makes me so happy as you guys can tell with like the t-shirt like I'm still in my mermaid era so I definitely needed to pick this up and I believe you probably could still find this at the parks I know they had like a few other options but I definitely wanted this one because I just think Hallie is so pretty and I'm so happy to have her the next item that I got is a t-shirt and this one I wasn't expecting to get at all but like when I saw it I was like I need this so I picked up the wonderful world of color t-shirt and of course what gravitates me towards the t-shirt is it's purple but it basically has like an outline of the castle in the back and then it says Walt Disney's Wonderful World of Color and then it has Tinkerbell on there. I think that this is part of like the Disney 100 like retro or just like era collection that they have going on because Walt Disney World of Color was like a TV show that was on back in the day and stuff and so I'm pretty sure like this is what like the logo for that looked like and everything so I just thought it was really cute so I wanted to pick it up and it also reminds me of the World of Color show that they currently have at Disneyland called World of Color 1 for the Disney 100 celebration so I just knew I needed to pick it up and I got a size medium actually I typically get like larges like the two t-shirts that I got from Adelaide's 4 are actually a large but this one already had an oversized fit so I just got a medium for this shirt and it fits nicely so I'm really happy with the shirt and it's so cute and comfortable and again another like t-shirt for lounging around at home or just like running errands or anything like that so super happy with this and the last item that I got for my recent trip to Disneyland is a Noemos you guys I finally caved and got a Noemos like I think if you watch some of my Disney vlogs you would know that I've just been eyeing the Noemos for the longest time but I just never could bring myself to get one but this one one I just could not resist because it's Mulan I just think she is so precious and I, I just needed her like I literally only got the Noemos I'm not gonna get like any of the clothes or that I'm not gonna go down that rabbit hole I'm pretty sure this was like 20 bucks I want to say but I just think Mulan looks so adorable in her little green dress I specifically love how she is in her green dress because I actually feel like a lot of her merch is in her pink dress and I'm like slowly getting into pink a little more but I still think this dress is really really cute and I would have wanted this more than the pink dress so I'm really really happy with her and I want to also like accessorize her with like my Disney outfit sometimes because I saw that you could like have a rubber band like around their arms and just like tied around a strap so you could have it like right here I think that's super cute but either way I'm really happy to have like my first and only Nuimos in my collection I I'm really really trying to be good and like not buy any more new emos but you know this one I just couldn't resist because it's Milan and I love her so much okay and now I'm finally going to share with you guys everything that I got for my trip to Disneyland Paris it's been a few months since my trip and I can't believe I haven't shown you guys I actually did a haul on my TikTok and my Instagram but I still wanted to show my YouTube 
family just in case you haven't seen it already so I didn't go too crazy at Disneyland Paris I honestly wasn't super in love with all of the merch at Disneyland Paris the merch that I really really gravitated towards was the 30th anniversary merch and as you guys will see that's like pretty much the only merch that I got so the first two items that I got are these two pins let me actually take them out of the plastic here they are I just think these are so pretty and again I really really love the 30th branding because it has like purple and blues but this first one over here it basically just has the Sleeping Beauty castle and the 30th logo and I really think it's so cute because it kind of looks like a Mickey and then it has Disneyland Paris on the bottom and then this pin here has the Fab Four on there so it has Mickey Minnie, Donald and Goofy and I just thought it was really fun because like it spins if you guys can see. Oops. Oh my gosh okay there you go see it spins and I really like this pin because they're wearing their cute little 30th outfits and their 30th outfits are so adorable so I really like these two pins again these are pretty much like the only pins that I got they didn't really have any like generic Disneyland Paris merch I actually feel like a lot of their merch was pretty similar to the merch that we have at Disneyland so I kind of I only gravitated toward the 30th merch the next item I absolutely just knew I wanted to get I am a big collector of the Starbucks you are here collection so of course I needed to get one from Disneyland Paris and they actually had so many different options so like they had the 30th one and then they had a generic Disneyland Paris mug and then they also had a Walt Disney Studios one I think and then they also had an Avengers Campus one so they basically had a lot of options I honestly would have brought home more if I had more room in my luggage but I didn't have that much space so I only picked up one I picked up the Disneyland 30th anniversary mug and I was debating between this one and like the more generic Disneyland Paris one but I decided to go with this one because I feel like this is a little bit more special since I was actually there during the 30th so I just thought that was really cute basically when you take it out so it has their castle space mountain and then small world and then i think this is called like treasure island i want to say and then it has their little teacups on there so i'm really really excited about this mug again i collect these so i have some from disneyland and i have some from disney california adventure and i'm pretty sure i have like a few versions of those and then i also have a mug from walt disney world maybe one day i'll show you guys my little collection in like a vlog or something but i love collecting these and i haven't used these because i'm trying to save them for when like I move out because I don't want to ruin these so I'm saving it for when I move out but either way super excited to have this mug this is definitely something that I absolutely knew I wanted to get like when I was going on my trip and then the last item that I got from Disneyland Paris is this adorable Minnie Mouse t-shirt and I think she's so adorable again she's wearing her little 30th outfit so she just has on a pink dress and then in the back it says or I don't know if you can tell but it still says like the 30th symbol and then I think it has like some stars on there but I really wanted to pick this up to commemorate the 30th anniversary and they had like a few different versions like I'm pretty sure they had like a pink one and a blue one but of course I went with the purple one and it's actually a really comfortable fit I think I actually just got a small medium so I think these were meant to be a little oversized so either way I'm really happy that I got this and on the side here it says Disneyland Paris as well like on the little arm cuff so i'm really really happy i picked this up and that pretty much wraps up this haul i hope you guys enjoyed i know i've had a few of these items for a long time but i'm super excited that i was finally able to share them with you guys and i'm also really excited to wear some of the clothing items that i got i was waiting till i filmed this video to wear them so i could show you guys first so i'm excited to finally be able to wear them but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here if you guys liked it please go ahead and give it a thumbs up let me know in the comments what was your favorite item from this haul. I would love to know. Be sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video from me. Let's stay connected. Follow me on my socials. We both just kill as ever after. And I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I love you guys so much. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.